if you've ever seen the movie Tangled by Disney, um, the 3D one, uh, it is a a movie that's really marked by other things um, as a as having one of the most magnificent scenes of lanterns lifting into the sky. I think uh, Jen's a very big fan of the movie, and uh, when uh, when she first uh, when first watched it. Uh, that 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 scene really stayed with me, and um, Jen eventually found that this existed in real life, and uh, she found on Facebook one day that there was a group called Rise, and that they were doing pretty much this in real life. Uh, it was it was something that we definitely wanted to go to, um, just to experience the you know to experience the. Um, the splendor. What, the, what would it look like to see thousands of lanterns just float up in the air? We had no idea what we were getting into a couple of years ago. And uh, Rise is just this very simple event. You come to a, a lake bed, a dried out lake bed in the Moapa Reservation in Nevada, right outside, 30 minutes outside of Las Vegas, and you and, and you're given a couple lanterns, and they have food trucks, and you can drink a couple beers there's no cell signal or anything you're that far away from um any kind of um any kind of civilization so this is not something you periscope which is i i almost think it's, it's something that they planned and you just you, you you're given four lanterns uh well i guess you're given two lanterns each we get four and you're just encouraged to write whatever you want on those lanterns you're encouraged to um you know, if you're honoring a loved one, uh, I remember two years ago when we when we first went, uh, a family next to us having you know um, welcoming their son back home from uh, from overseas from the military. Um, other people have just put very simple sort of you know uh, peace messages on those things, and um, as for us, we've put many messages um, on them and. We've launched about, I guess, 12 of them at this point. Uh, and, you know, one has always been, one or more have always been about us, uh, about family, uh, about shouting out the loved ones that we, that we care about, um, whether they're related by blood or otherwise. And I've always launched one for, uh, for Twitch as well, since by the time I started uh, we started doing the Rise Festival. Uh, I was already working at Twitch. What the, what this festival means to me, um, and why I'm why I'm sharing it is it, it's something that photos and video can never can never ever replicate. Like you can't get the feeling, even though I might try my hardest, uh, and even Rise may try it will try its hardest to try and uh, put out some kind of media around like what this looks like it like it, just, it doesn't do it justice um it's something that you def definitely have to it's a spirit it's definitely like the most spiritual sort of event that i've ever been to and i've now been to it three years in a row um i'm not a person that necessarily i guess puts any credence into any kind of the, any, into any of this stuff Ma mainly because um you know, I, I'm very, I can't even say logical at that point. I, I, I can mainly just say I'm, I'm a person that just really, you know, it's hard for me to, to, to shed a tear. It's hard for me to get emotional about certain things, even though I show a lot of emotion and through the videos that you've seen on YouTube, it, it, it's, it's pretty clear that I can, but in a more spiritual manner, it's really tough for me to kind of put myself in a situation that you can just look up and be in awe of the, you know, of, of something, of something that's greater than yourself. And Rai showed me that. And Rai shows me that every year. Um, to see that many wishes, to see that many lights in the air, and, and, and like, you know, you take 20, 20 minutes on a lantern, just, just drawing on it, and you're like, you know, this is my wish and have it join the thousands of wishes that, that are up there and just have it float away. It is something that I can't, that can't be replicated by anything else. And to be able to share it with Jen every single year just makes it all the more special to me. 
Um, it is an, it is an, as important as an event to us as like Comic Con or TwitchCon or going to Japan. Um, th this is an event that just absolutely means so much to us. And all we're doing is launching a lantern. Um, but it's not just that. It's, it's a, it's a journey. It's a reset. It's a, um, it's perspective. Jen says it's perspective. And I believe that like it gives you perspective over what you've been doing over the past year and what you will be doing over the next. Um, and I, I really hope that, um, you kind of look at, like, if you ever find yourself in a situation where you're like, Hey, I can, I can actually attend this thing that you do. Um, bring your family, bring your friends, just go by yourself. Uh, be, be one with your thoughts and, and write whatever you want to write and launch that into the air. Uh, as they say there, we all rise together. And I firmly, every year I hear it, the more I believe it. And we will keep going as much as we can. Um, wishes like this, I feel, and gestures like this just mean so much. And uh, I feel like in this day and age, we don't have that. You know, we, we you, there's some there's some emotions that can't be shown in a tweet, or in a Facebook post, or even on a stream. It, it's something that requires the splendor of something greater. And again, I hope that someday you're able to experience this for yourself. You'll probably see us experiencing it with you. <laughs>